plays games with Steve and Angel. Uh, let's, uh, let's talk to Gumshoe. Oh, now you want to talk. Detective Gumshoe? Any idea what strategy Von Karma is planning for tomorrow? It sounds like he's bringing in another witness. Another witness? Oh, right. He said something about that in the trial today. There were two witnesses. Damn, his voice got even lower. Yeah. I was wondering who that other witness was. Both of you, do the deepest voice you can. Say, I'm Manfred Von Karma in your deepest voice. I'm Manfred Von Karma. Okay, and then Steve? I'm Manfred Von Karma. I don't even know if that's the deepest I can go on. Why do we have to go around here? I'm Manfred Von Karma. I'm Manfred Von Karma. This is how I sounded when I was trying to straight pass around my family. Who me from my slumber? <laughs> Who disturbs my I slumber? Well, Don't, would that be deeper? Is that because I mean, that's just right. like a, putting on uh, like a monster voice? Uh, yeah, I mean, oh, now we're just getting distracted. Let's hey, go. hey, Detective Gumshoe, what's your best Von Karma impression? Uh, I, I, oh, oh, I'm big and scary and old. Ooh, that's good. Thank you. Uh, uh, who was it? Uh, sorry, pal. As much as I'd like to, I'm not at liberty to divulge that information. Divulge. Right. It's just not a word I would think you would say. Oh, I'm sorry. Uh, g give Cher that info. <laughs> I'm just big dumb baby man. <laughs> Playing with my gun. <laughs> <laughs> oh, right. I wanted to ask you something about Edgeworth. What's up? Is he afraid of earthquakes? I never heard anything about that before. Mr. Edgeworth doesn't talk about himself too much, see? Uh, but there's one thing that's clear as day. Him hating crime the way he does, and him becoming a lawyer, and him being scared of earthquakes. It all started with that incident. The DL6 incident? Yep, that's the one. Fifteen years ago, when he saw his father shot before his very eyes. He still feels the pain now, you can see it in his eyes. Oh my god. I wanted to talk to you about Maya Faye. Huh? Uh, she's not out on bail yet? That's strange. I told them to let her go as soon as they had their report written up. Man, I don't know what would have happened in that courtroom today if it weren't for her. Seeing her get dragged out by the bailiff? I'll be honest with you, pal. I shed a tear or two. Aww. Edgeworth, he was so moved I saw his lip trembling. Oh my god. Really? Cold as ice, Edgeworth? He was really grateful for what she did, you know. I'm gonna head back to the station. I'll get the report on Maya and get her out of there as soon as I can. Thank you. Oh, wait. Um, I was wondering, how much is bail going to be? Don't worry about that. Miss Edgeworth is posting the whole amount. What? Edgeworth? Didn't I tell you? He's grateful to her for what she did. All right, pal. Well, don't forget to go pick her up, okay? Hmm. Maybe I could get Edgeworth to pay this month's rent, too. Yeah, there's <laughs> be my sugar it. daddy. Mm. Edgeworth did that? Stone Cold Steve Edgeworth? <laughs> <laughs> You're as cold as ice. Do you think Edgeworth does that thing that you do where he insists on trying to pay the bill first? Oh, the <laughs> suha? Yeah. Yeah, uh, yeah. Uh, uh, yeah, I could... Ma maybe. I could see it. I think it'd be funny. I have already paid. God damn it. <laughs> <laughs> ha, 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 ha. I'm the best. Uh, is the rental shop ever going to be relevant? I don't know. Mm -hmm. oh. Can you imagine it was just a completely pointless area? <laughs> Looks like the boat rental shop is closed today, too. <laughs> and I was right. Oh, God. <laughs> was it really? Yeah, they're not going to do anything there. Uh, okay, well, it's not Christmas, so... Uh... Small small a small boat rental shop. I just look like anyone's around. Oh, they're probably closed because of the murder. If okay. the boat rental shop isn't relevant, that doesn't exist. <laughs> the boat rental shop does not exist. Um, mean Girls. Um, right? Mean Girls? That's what you were doing? Oh, no. I was actually qu quoting Attack of the Clones. <laughs> oh. Never mind. This is what happens with too many references. <laughs> yeah. 
or just a soup. Maybe a I'll soup. give up references for Lent next year or something. God, Honestly. you would not last an hour. <laughs> <laughs> it'd be like it'd practically be me like just holding my breath. You know? <laughs> Go to hell immediately. Yeah. Um I guess I'll go to that. Wow. Yeah, I'd love to be down there in hell with some of the worst worst mankind has to offer. And what did you what did you do to deserve this sort of you know, eternal, you know, suffering? It's like I mean, I just said one too many Simpsons lines and just whoa. Mm -hmm. I was quoting Rograts. Yeah. Putting scene. You both deserve it. Yeah. All right. Right. You have all the Simpsons references in the world. Hey Nick, you finally came. They just finished the paperwork. I'm free to go. Free at last, eh? Free at last. Free at last. Thank God Almighty, we're free at last. Those interrogators were really mean. They were like, okay, what did you do this time? Like I was some kind of criminal. Can you believe it? Well, they let you out in the end, didn't they? Mm. Oh, that reminds me. Thanks for the bail. Thank Edgeworth. Huh? He posted bail for you. Said he was grateful for what you did. Mr. Edgeworth did that? Uh, I have to make it up to him. We've got to win this case, Nick. Yeah, we do. Uh, okay, so is it? No. Oh, uh, Maya, don't no. You want, Maya, don't you want to get out from back there? Nah. Nah, it's, I made it like in my little apartment. Yeah. It's like a little studio apartment. They bolted my feet to the ground. <laughs> uh, okay, so it just became the law offices. Um, they said Grossberg it's was like, it's out. It's like Batman for the talking to Paul Dano <laughs> Riddler. The couch is vibrating. Um, oh yeah, my leg's shaking. <laughs> it's funny you do it. It's an earthquake. Uh, are, are, are you guys leg shakers? Um, I am a little bit. I'm pretty bad about it. Uh, it's fine though. <laughs> I was just pointing it out. Um, I just want to give everyone uh, watching at home the, the experience of what it's like to be on this couch. See, we need the pros D plays games 4D experience. Like <laughs> uh, when I'm shaking my leg, uh, yeah. you know, um, oh. you can uh, have a, listen to us drink Diet Coke in your ears. Uh, mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh, yeah. People love that. <sighs> Yeah. Um, they love when you eat. They love when you whistle. Uh, mm -hmm. All right, let, let's, let's 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 try some other places. Um, where haven't we been? Uh, Have you been to? Oh, oh, I guess here again. There aren't many cops around today, are there? They're probably back at the precinct working up the case against Edgeworth. Hmm. Hey y'all! Howdy y'all! <laughs> <laughs> Hey, it's Lana. <laughs> hey, it's Lana. It's the prosecutor. <laughs> oh, God. Uh, Y'all really did it today. Uh, what did we do now? No, I'm not complaining. See, I did a little thinking. A little self-reflection, you might say. I realized that being a witness is a mighty big responsibility. <laughs> yeah. But I just went up there and started blabbing and any old thing that came to mind. Lotta. So you see, I want to make it up to y'all. Make it up? Oh. Lotta, that's called <laughs> perjury. Perjury, yeah. <laughs> oh, God. Uh, today's trial. What did you think of the trial? To be honest, I was doing it half just to say I'd be, uh, I'd been a witness. Even though I didn't really see anything. Kind of convinced myself I had though. I'm sorry, I know I caused y'all a lot of trouble. Well, memory is a tricky, vague little thing. Yeah, I sure know that. Oh my god. Yeah, I sure know that now. What's up? <laughs> it's, it's okay. I got this. You want me, you want me to... No, 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 no. It's fine. Um, is your voice okay? No, I'm just... It, Slip at the top. Late night session. Late night session. Okay. Right. Okay. A lot of heart. A lot of heart. heart it's like heart of the South. Heart of the South. I got this. Okay. <laughs> I'll be Do fine. Do you? <laughs> <laughs> I'll be fine the next time I witness a murder. Right. You mean the first time you witness a murder? Oh. Oh. <laughs> Let's talk about Gordy. What about Gordy? Right. Well, the way I figure, the trial's only <laughs> the trial's only stoking the flames of Gordy fever. I'll get, I'll get my exclusive photos and rocket to stardom. All right, Lada, you go, girl. I wish I could be an investigative photographer too. 
Photographer, too. Finish your spirit medium training first. Why can't I do both? Can't be a boss bitch and just do it all. You know, that's true, Maya. Lada, what do you mean by making it up to us? Well, you see... Actually, I got a bit of information for you. W what? That Von Karma didn't want me to say nothing about it. W what information? Now we're getting to the heart of it. See, I reckon we might be able to do ourselves a little exchange. I exchange? <laughs> um, I thought this was to make it up to us. Right. I propose a little exchange to make it up to you. Oh my God. What? Information don't come cheap, my friend. Uh. Hey. I see you thinking, my, how unsophisticated these Southern folks are. It's written all over your face. Let me tell you, most Southerners are way more sophisticated than ye. I'm just the exception, okay? <laughs> well, what it'll be? You got a deal or not? Deal or no deal. What do we do, Nick? Show me the briefcase. A uh, deal. I have never deal. seen the show. Uh, at all. A deal. We don't have any other leads, so I don't think we have a choice here. Okay, how much? Huh? You completely off your rocker? I may not be sophisticated, but I'm not trying to rob the poor. Damn, I'm calling those huh? poor. <laughs> the only fair exchange is information. For <laughs> information is information. Listen good. What I need from you is information about Gordy. Whoa, 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 whoa. G Gordy? But, but Gordy doesn't, I mean, I mean, Gordy might not exist. Then bring me proof that he sho that shows he don't. Uh. I'll be keeping watch from the car, okay? Oh my God. Cause I'm not letting you near it. <laughs> <laughs> you see, so gonna... I, I see the problem is I live in it. <laughs> oh, oh. <laughs> you see something, y'all come to me first. Got it? Uh, okay. Right. See y'all later. Yep, that's my name. Right. <laughs> and I'm a lot of heart. Right. And I'm right. Okay, Nick. Let's get on to I'm sorry. You want me to do a... Huh? <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. I'd appreciate it. Uh, hunting. You don't seriously mean... Gordy. I sure... Gordy? I sure do. What about Edgeworth? We're searching for Gordy for him, Nick. Don't you get it? Okay, and... How exactly do we search for a make-believe monster? Maybe we can find a monster myth specialist? Edgeworth, we brought you the head of Gordy. <laughs> what am I supposed to do with this? Right, they think I shot someone. Oh. <laughs> Interesting. What's that? The, the Steel Samurai, Nick. Yo, Maya! Larry. What the heck is this? Oh, it was my girl Keonce's idea. She was all, if you like, if, if you like put this here, it would be like really cool. Dude, she gave it, she gave it to me along with the banner. Wow, that's really impressive. She could find those for you. Well, she knows a lot of people. And that show is finished now, so she's got them for free. Oh. Right. 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 Um, so th these banners, like the flags, those are new too? Those weren't here before? Uh, I don't remember them being there. No. Oh, okay. Those flags look sadly out of place here. Flapping listlessly back and forth in a cold wind under a cold sky. That's getting poetic again. I don't know, I think it gives the place a kind of festival atmosphere. It reminds me of the War of the Eyeglasses. The War of the what? What? You mean, you don't know the War of the Eyeglasses? What the heck is it? Our local fair used to do it every summer. Huh, I guess we were the only ones. I ask again, what the heck is it? Wow, you didn't go out to any, uh, festivals? Doesn't that steel samurai look a little out of place? I mean, it's so huge. I guess it's good advertising. Mmm. Something about this steel samurai just doesn't work for me. Huh, really? Looks pretty well made to me. Hmm. Still a novice, aren't you, Nick? Really? True connoisseurs like Cody and me don't fall for this kind of stuff. These Steel Samurai fans are obviously in a league of their own. You still talk with that kid? Yeah. 
He's a boy. We're friends on Blue Sky. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, too bad the sky is gray today. Cold <laughs> and gray. All right. It's almost uh, a high At least he's not doing that stupid sprite. Data. All right. Edgeworth. Oh, do it again. Yo, Nick! Oh. What happened with Edgeworth? That's my least favorite one. Well, we made it through the first day in court, all right. I don't know how good our prospects are from here on, though. Huh? Hey, Larry, did you know Edward's secret weakness? He's terrified of earthquakes. It's so funny. What a dork. He acts like a little boy. Uh, uh, earthquake, I'm traumatized. Huh? That's weird. I don't think he was ever like that in school. No? Really? Well, we were only in the same class for a year. He transferred schools pretty quickly. Transferred? Right, when the DL6 incident happened. Doesn't look like Larry knows about it, though. The big samurai. Hey, Larry. What was that big thing up there before? Huh? Oh, the big guy? I've heard that for about a month. I've had that for about a month. Yeah. It's a big hit with the kids. Why wasn't it there yesterday? Huh? Huh? Oh, oh, right. The, the compressor was busted. Compressor? Yeah, it's that little unit by my hot dog stand. That's what I use to put air in the Steel Samurai. Broke a little while ago, so I sent it in for repairs. Oh, and here I thought you inflated it by yourself. Okay. With my ego, or my, <sighs> or the air in my head. Ha ha ha. A ha, got him. A ha ha. A ha, -ha. What's Mosey? Uh, all right. Move, move somewhere else. Uh, Time to move let's somewhere go back to else. the woods. Did y'all ever have a, a little bounce house for any of your birthday parties or anything? Uh, no. never at my birthday parties. Okay. But. I will say, just a disclaimer, I wasn't wealthy or anything. It was just that we had a neighbor who would rent them out. Mm -hmm. um, yeah. So we got like a huge discount. Um, oh. And one night we like kept it overnight, and I just like slept with my uh, like outside with my siblings, like and just kind of like oh that's fun star like star uh, stars viewed no that's not the word stargaze stargaze that's it yeah sure it was really it was awesome that's cool hi it, it's me again she's not <laughs> hey talking about bounce houses oh those are fun uh well y'all find anything about Gordy? Um, no, nothing. Well, keep moving. Gets cold out here in that time. It is a little chilly. I, I think I have to sneeze. Uh. Whoa, whoa! No, you don't. Now sneeze it. What? <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh! I told you now sneezing. See, I see. I set the camera to respond to things a little softer than a bang. A trigger on one of Von Karma's finger snaps now. Oh, I'm sorry. Yeah, well, sorry's nice, but what about my film? Nick, pay the lady. <laughs> Damn. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go off while she's yelling. I learned something in today's trial, that's for sure. Testifying is serious business. That's why I decided not to talk about that case anymore. Huh? Whoa, didn't you say you had information about the case? Tell us that at least. Like I said, I'll trade it for the dirt on Gordy. Um, would this just be repeating? Probably, Ooh, yeah. Who's okay. Gordy? This is Gordy. <laughs> What's a Krabby Patty? Where, where, where? Um, all right. Okay. Will there be anything at this rental shop? Let's find out. Ooh, I wonder. Bolt <gasps> <gasps> rental shop? Hmm. It's always so quiet here. I wonder if the boat shop is closed for good. Well, with the murder on the lake and all, they're probably just taking a vacation till it blows over. I get it. No, it'll never be important. Go away. <laughs> no! Go away. Go away. Go away. Uh, Why don't you go visit your boy? Um, okay. Now tell me twice. Why are you leaving? 
<laughs> uh, yeah, it, oh no 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 no, no, no. I was kidding oh, yeah no it was joke Larry we hate his guts Larry. we hate that man Larry Larry that man is terrible the joke man is Larry is your boy yeah. but you hate Larry go find hotty man Larry Larry dirty man he, he bad bad <laughs> dude <laughs> hey there pal what's up. You look out of sorts. Yeah, I just uh, ran into someone I really hate. Wait, you didn't go and do something that's gonna hurt Mr. Edwards' case again. What do you mean, again? Whatever, have a seat, pal. I'm here for you if you need anything. Besides money, that is. Oh. <laughs> he takes I'm... someone else's office chair and someone's like, uh, what the hell? And like, if he like, takes it back. Uh, <laughs> here, have a seat. Uh, that's my chair, dick. Oh, <laughs> sorry. <laughs> Okay, the investigation. How is the investigation <laughs> proceeding? What the hell does that mean? <laughs> it's not, really. We have another meeting coming up. We're supposed to talk about Mr. Edgeworth's motive. His motive? See, Mr. Edgeworth's father died in the DL6 incident, and the guy who got the lone suspect declared innocent was the victim in this case, Robert Hammond. They're saying that's why Mr. Edgeworth shot him. And Edgeworth never talks about his past. I bet they'll drag that out and hit him with it in court tomorrow, too. Poor Edgeworth. I gotta admit, it doesn't look good, pal. Poor Edgeworth. Out there all alone. <laughs> See? No more tears, gumshoe. <laughs> <laughs> what? Wait, what? <laughs> it's, a, it's, a, it's a Peter Pan. Oh my god. Poor Nana. Out there all alone. Anyway. You I found it. You found it. I haven't seen Peter Pan in a hot minute. Uh, say, Detective Gumshoe, do you know Gordon? No, I don't need to. <laughs> I can just watch it, you know, at the dentist today. Because oh. I had nothing to do. I was watching it in my... <laughs> oh, I was about to... Wait, you just, like, whipped out your phone and just was watching No, it? he, no, like, I met... knows the movie. I know the movie so well. Oh. I can close my eyes and just watch the movie. Was it... Well... Post was it where it was like a kid like could you do that Shrek? Okay, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Stop watching Shrek in your head. Yeah. Um, <laughs> the monster down. Uh, oh, I'm sorry. You oh, want to... oh, okay. The do monster it. down in Gord Lake. Not personally, no. That's a terrible. Well, we're looking for him. Huh? Are you out of your minds? Eek! You got time to go wild monster hunting? How about doing a little questioning for me then? That's another Capcom game. Oh, Detective Gumshoe is scaring me, Nick. What? His voice sounds different. Is this a game over? <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> that to My sure dies. Not to deal with Lada. <laughs> but it was too late. <laughs> uh, there was a lot of... Uh, Nick, try telling him sooner next time. Er, sorry. Hmm. I see, pal. Sorry for shouting at you. Okay. I, Detective Gumshoe, will aid your search for Gordy. Uh-huh. I'll loan you one of our newest secret weapons for finding evidence. Really? You can take whichever one you like. <laughs> it's like it hands like a bunch of guns. <laughs> God. Okay, give us the goods. Hold on now, everything in due time. First, let me show them to you. These are our best and brightest. Introducing the secret weapon number one, missile. M missile? He's a canine police dog, still in training. <gasps> missile, missile here, boy. Oh, a puppy. It's oh, missile. My God. Here he is. Hey, he's cute. Look, Nick, cute dog. A cute, cute dog. dog. I want, want, sorry. I want to be everybody. A cute dog. This will help us how? Next, secret weapon number two, a fishing pole. Hello! Oh, oh wow, I didn't know it talked. Here, this is my own personal <laughs> pole. Oh, God, it talks. I'm Polly, the fishing pole. <laughs> pole, pole! <laughs> uh, I'm gonna break it in half, I think. <laughs> Detective Gumshoe, we're looking for a monster. Uh, this pole might be a monster. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> How are we supposed to catch a whole sea monster with a fishing pole? Never know till you try, pal! Duh. Okay, this next one is the last one. 
No, please. I'm already overwhelmed by our choices. Secret weapon number three, a metal detector. Detect, detect. Here. <laughs> Detective Gumshoe. We're looking for something alive. I think all of these might be. <laughs> all right. How are we supposed to find it with a metal detector? Hey, you never know. It might have been eating soda cans. Well, which will it be? Um, I can't make up my mind, Nick. Uh, they all seem so perfect. I can't make up my mind either. For the totally opposite reason. Oh, well. I suppose it can't hurt to borrow one of them. What? what which one would you pick? Although I'm going to maybe just give you the answer on this. Um... Okay, well, let me get my full thought. Okay, obviously, missile is very, 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 very tempting because dog. Mm -hmm. um, borrow the fishing pole. So we're probably going to fish something out of the lake and, mm -hmm. and, you know, prove that, you know, Gordy's a hoax. Mm -hmm. Borrow the metal detector. Um, I don't know. This probably would be a more boring solution. Like, oh, this is a, you know, a, a fragment of like what people thought was Gordy and it leads to the like big inflatable or something. I don't know. But missile sounds like the most fun option. Mm. Unless the fishing pole can actually talk. Uh, pick the metal detector. <laughs> okay. the I'm just going to save you some time. Yeah. Would these be game over? No, no. no. I think you can, maybe there's like some funny dialogue. Yeah, there's like something like interesting. There's some fun little bonus dialogue. But it'd be so much backtracking. Yeah. Oh, okay. I was like, well, we yeah. can't just go back and... Okay. Sorry, honey. Do it on your own. <laughs> All right. <laughs> I'll just look up the, the options that have been online. Can we borrow that metal detector? Sure thing, pal. I'm not sure what we're going to find with this. Remember, you're hunting for a monster. Anything is possible. Anything. All right, borrow the, borrow the metal detector. Metal detector. Metal, metal. All right. Is that... Wait, was that, that it? That part's definitely a little tricky, though, because if you pick the wrong item, you just don't know. Yeah. <laughs> oh. Um, yeah. Okay, let's go to the beach. Beach. Let's go. Let's... Okay, so when you guys do let's go, I think of the Ariana Grande TikTok, where it's Ariana Grande as Mario. Mamma Mia. <laughs> the Mushroom Kingdom. Let's go. Ah, we have a new contender. Yeah, yeah. That's new challenger. <laughs> so yeah. Well, you, like that's the thing. You could like it's like just three different just <laughs> sides of the internet now. Yeah. We got like the anime, we got the TikTok, and then we got the YouTube poops. Vote for your favorite one in the comments. Do it. Wow, that really does represent us. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that's the trifecta. I'm the anime. You're a YouTube poop, and you're a Ariana, Ariana Grande TikTok. Mm -hmm. Stan. Yeah. Oh, uh, Nick. Detect, detect. It's beeping and it's talking. The metal detectors found something. Oh my God, Maya, could it be? Am it be? I alive? <laughs> uh, your, your purpose is to detect metal. Uh, Maya, is the boat rental shop? I love relevant? you. Oh, oh my God. We don't need this thing anymore. <laughs> oh God. Sure is loud enough <laughs> about it. Whatever it is, it must be in those bushes. Go check it out, Maya. Why do I have to check it out? Uh, mm -hmm. Nick, look. Uh, it's a bottle and the flag. Huh? An air tank? Uh, okay. Huh? The valve looks broken. I thought it was Gordy. Maya, first of all, first of all, <laughs> why would Gordy be in the bush? Dr. Wiley. <laughs> and second of all, why would a metal detector react to a sea monster? Oh, I don't know what you're referencing right now. <laughs> actually, I know, first of all, it's actually a Game Grumps thing. I don't know if you've ever seen the oh, no. Mickey Mouse. Anyway. Oh, I thought, uh, no. I thought you were doing like a Columbo thing. I was doing Doctor... I thought I was doing Doctor... Yeah, and then, then I realized, did, yeah, wait, then first of all, it's actually a Game Grumps thing. Oh, anyway. Okay. Huh? There's, oh. some, there's something wrapped around this air tank. Looks like a string of flags? Well, we might as well take it with us now that we found it. It's heavy. You take it. <laughs> Ooh, <laughs> oh. <laughs> All right, lift your legs. Um, wow, it was relevant, and that was it. Um, goodbye, both house. Goodbye forever. Goodbye. Goodbye. <laughs> Just. 
fades away. Wait, no, stay there. Why? Why? Because look, look at the air tank. <laughs> Um, no, no, stay, no, no, Angel. No, no, Angel. Angel. You gotta listen to me. Wait, what? Go Sorry. back to your favorite boy. No. Because <laughs> uh... what's on the what's on the air tank, Angel? The flags. Does and what's on here, Angel? Uh, does it? Do we, wait, do we show it? Angel? What do you think you do, Angel? I don't know. I don't freaking know. We saw the metal detector. I don't make freaking know. <laughs> I don't make freaking know. What? An air tank? What about it? Larry, I wanted to ask you about this tank. Have you seen it before? Is it yours? Uh, these are the same question. They're not. Sort of. Uh, have you seen it before? Have you seen this before? Huh? Me? N no, never. Who the heck would go diving in the middle of the winter? Mm. There's something about the way his eye twitched when I showed him the tank. I think I better pursue this line of questioning a little further. Let's try that again. Pick the other one this time. Let me pick the other one. Yeah. Yeah. All the options. Really? really? Yeah. Really? What? An air tank? What about it? What about it? Yeah. I want to ask you about the tank. Right, that's that uh, is it yours? Say, is this air tank yours? <laughs> Why would I have a thing like that? Look, see how there's a string of flags around the tank valve? It's just like the string of flags around your steel samurai there. Hmm? <laughs> Must be a coincidence. There's a string of flags everywhere these days. Like elementary schools uh, and used car dealerships. Look, why would I need a tank anyway? Mm, air tank to go diving or to inflate something? You used this to inflate that, didn't you? It... Inflate what? What else? That big puffy steel samurai. Mm. Mm. Now, why would you go asking me a question like that? Looks like I hit the nail on the head. Mm. Right, right. Actually, um... See, the compressor I always use was on the fritz. So I tried using the tank to inflate it, just once. And uh, it, it didn't go so well. As I suspected. Hmm. Ask more about Why on earth would you put <laughs> the tank away? Well, it didn't go so well? Uh, yeah. Uh, do you think you could be a little more specific? C -c -c Come on. Look, it's embarrassing, so I really don't want to talk about it. Tell us, tell us. Mm hmm? Fine. Whatever. It's like what I said, the compressor was busted. So I took the tank and tried to fill the samurai up with that. And then... Blam! Oh, shit. The valve busted open and made this incredible noise. And the tank... And that, and that tank there took off like a rocket. And it took my poor deflated steel samurai with it. What? Off into Gord Lake? Sure scared me out of my gourd, that's for sure. Mm -hmm. Uh... Now no, I can talk to him. Okay. Um... So, the tank and the seal samurai you were trying to fill up flew away. What happened next? Well, all that happened on the 20th or so. The 20th? A week ago. Now, as far as I could see, the tank went flying out into the lake. So I went out every night in a boat looking for it. I mean, Keonse gave me that steel samurai after all. And when did you find it? Just the night before last. It flew way, it flew way out there. It took me four whole days to find it. The night before last was the night of the murder. Sorry for not tell. Oh, <laughs> oh, oh, by all means. Sorry for not telling you, Nick. Oh my god. Actually, I was here on the night of the murder, but you see, I went home before midnight. So you didn't know about what happened? No. <laughs> That's too bad. It's, it's not, not all. It's not all bad. Oh. We solved one mystery at least. A mystery. 
<laughs> Maybe we should go tell her. All right. That was short and uh, painless. <laughs> I only have to do like two lines with him. Talk uh, to Lada Heart now. Oh, oh there she oh, is. Oh. It's like you oh. got evidence about Gordy. Do I talk to her about Gordy? Present, present that shit. Present that shit. If you want a new thing, do present do, 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 the do, air do, tank do. to. Yep, I have to say I know exactly squat about that. I guess we were wrong. Oh, what? Whoopsie daisy. I guess maybe you have to prompt it with the Gordy thing. Whatever. Anyway. Talk to me about Gordy now. Wow. Maybe you should trust my instinct. Well, Mr. Mm -hmm. Lawyer, I've got the info y'all need. All right. I'm sorry. Let's trust Angel's instincts and wait 30 <laughs> minutes before you come. I got the scoop on Gordy for yeah. me yet. Um, Gordy doesn't exist. Gordy mm. doesn't exist. We found him, Lotta. There is no such thing as Gordy. But what? How can y'all be so sure? Really, Nick? Oh, my, we were there. Y'all got some proof Gordy don't exist? The proof that Gordy doesn't exist? Is here. It's out there somewhere. Of <laughs> course I have proof. No lawyer worth his badge would make a claim without the proof to back it up. Here's the proof that Gordy doesn't exist. Take that! Take that! Larry's air tank? What are y'all doing with an air tank? This is Gordy. Um, excuse me? What exactly are you saying, Nick? There's a stand near here, a hot dog stand. There's a giant inflatable samurai doll there. About a week ago, an idiot, who happens to be a friend of mine, <laughs> tried to fill it. He used this air tank, and when the valve blew, the tank flew into the lake. Apparently made a pretty loud bang when it flew. A bang? Oh. The tank, along with the still deflated samurai, fell into the lake. At the same time... Oh. A couple was taking a photograph of the lake. These two look so scary. I know. This photo. They're, they're dead-eyed. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> This is Junji Ito illustration. Yeah. Wait. So, you're saying that Gordy is really the Steel Samurai? Hmm. Hmm. Oh. Well, that's a fine way to ruin a gal's dreams. I'm sorry, Lotta. Nah, it's okay. You win. I'll give you your info, like I promised. Poor Lotta. Poor Lotta. <laughs> Out there in the woods. No more Gordy Lotta. <laughs> so tell us this information you have. Promise is a promise, I guess. By the way, the actual scene, for those of you who don't know Peter Pan by heart, uh, I don't know if there are any people like that out there, but it's poor Nana out there all alone, and the mom goes, no more tears, Michael. <laughs> but that's what I'm referencing. Yeah. Poor missile. <laughs> Poor missile. No. I overheard the cops around here saying something about the witness tomorrow. They said he's the caretaker of the boat rental place up the path <gasps> here. <gasps> oh my Angel. god! The boat rental house! Boat rental! <laughs> boat rental? There's someone there? We've been there like 30 <laughs> times and there's no one I fucking think, there I ever. Think, I think there's someone there that wasn't there before. before. <laughs> I mean, it looks so deserted. What's there, Maya? <laughs> Shh, I'll tell you when you're older. <laughs> <laughs> Just an old guy living all by himself. Y'all should go, y'all should go check it out. Thanks, Lotta. We will. I let's go. Cra let's get cracking, Nick. Let's go cracking. <laughs> Hold on. Something else? Yeah. Night of the murder. My camera clicked twice. You know. Uh huh. Wait. So you have another photo? Well. Yeah, but there's nothing in it at all. Just the like. I figured it wouldn't be much use as evidence. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Blah. I have a dance. <laughs> the, the hair in my mouth. <laughs> so I kept it myself. Well, it might not be helpful at all, but here, take it. A second link photo. Bye now. Y'all take care. Time for me to pack up and leave. 
No. Hmm. Poor Lada. Poor Lada. It's all Larry's fault. <laughs> the legend still lives on, I guess. The legend? Yeah, the legend of Larry. Familiar to all who know him for any length of time. <laughs> when something smells, it's usually the butts. Oh. Hmm. Someone should whip that butts into shape. To be fair, I'll come to the defense of Larry here. Larry was just trying to fill up an inflatable thing and just there was a mishap. Yeah. But it is Larry Butts. Yeah, so. fuck Larry. Okay, <laughs> never mind. Yeah. He's just the Eugene of the Ace Attorney universe, I guess. <laughs> Eugene? From uh, Harry Arnold. Arnold. Which one is Jinx. Eugene? He's the one that's always Is he the red-haired one? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm Mr. Lucky. <laughs> God. <laughs> Do you remember that episode? Mr. Lucky. The I... fireman is like, I'm hear that Arnold? His name's Lucky. And then when, like, the... The the cherry picker breaks. Doesn't like the fire is like, oh god, no, not again. <laughs> oh no, I don't remember that. God, I'm strange. No, no. Y I yes, was just thinking yes. about <laughs> <laughs> I was just thinking about God, um, I'm so desperately lonely. <laughs> he like got like a fish or something at the aquarium and then like it he got like eaten. Oh like, yeah. yeah. Oh uh, there's so many stuff. There's so many episodes. Yeah. Go to the boat rental house. We know you want to go. Please go to the boat <laughs> rental house. My God. Just, just go. I had to tease myself. I had to savor it. <laughs> Why don't they just go to the boat rental house? <laughs> Why are they still talking about hair at all? <laughs> hey, hey, Nick. This is the boat shop that Lot is talking about. Why are you saying it like that, Maya? You're right. <laughs> it's like we've never been here before. <laughs> Doesn't seem to be anyone here. That's at, at me, Maya. That's oh, my sorry. Line. Give me that fucking script. <laughs> <laughs> well, let's go check it out anyway. All right. Uh. uh, uh. <laughs> Small boat, <laughs> boat runner shop. shop. Like anyone is there's around. no, there's no fucking reason to be here. Wait, like, what do we click? No, no, no. You gotta get, get out. You can move, you can move, move. You can move, move. Caretaker. I like to move it, move it. Oh my god. Meg, right you? Hey, is that Keith with you? Where have you two been? I've been worried sick. Uh, Nick, you handle this. Uh, I think I'll leave this one up to you, Maya. Meg! I yes. <laughs> Finally made up your mind, have you? <laughs> my mind? You run the pasta shop when I'm gone? <laughs> pasta? Glad to hear it, glad to hear it. You make your old man proud. When you kids left the house, I didn't know what to think. How am I supposed to keep this place running, old man like me? Polly, the kids are home. Oh. Hello! Hello! <laughs> Nick, what was that? A parrot? The one on that perch? Keith! Y yes I leave the wet noodle in your capable hands, Shunny. Nick? What's the wet noodle? Um, based on the available evidence, I say it's the name of his pasta shop. <laughs> Shall we leave his in it, Polly? Hello! Hello! <laughs> yep! He fell asleep. I guess he's relieved. But they're not talking about Hey Arnold anymore. Yeah. <laughs> but, um, unfortunately, oh, we're out of time. I guess we'll have to just talk about, you know, in canon things next time. Yeah, I don't believe so. it. No. <laughs>